everybody, it's Asara and today I'm back with a makeup tutorial. Now this is a really fun festive look that I thought would be really great for the holiday season. Um, the best part is that I used, I think all of the products that I used are drugstore so you can recreate this look without breaking the bank. And if you want to see how I did it and what products I used then just keep watching. Alrighty, so starting off with the eyes, I'm just going to prime using my trusty Urban Decay Primer Potion, the original formula, and just apply that all over the lid. Next, to prepare for the darker color that I'm going to have in the crease, I'm going to take my CoverGirl Shadow Blast Duo and I'm using the darker two-step brown color. I'm just going to work that into the crease. Next, using the Milani Runway eyeshadow palette in number 5 Glamorous Gems, I'm going to take this white silvery shadow and using a flat shader brush apply it to the lid. Next, using that same palette, I'm going to go to the darkest color which is this nice bronze and work that into the crease where I applied my base color. Next, using the same bronzy color that I used in the crease, I'm going to take that on an angled brush and run that along my lower lash line. Next, I'm going to take the Maybelline Eye Studio Gel in Blackest Black and just line my top line. I'm going to flick it out at the end to create a little wing. Now that the eyeliner and the eyeshadow is done, I'm just going to give my lashes a quick curl and apply some mascara. And today I'm using the CoverGirl Clump Crusher Mascara. Alrighty, so for cheeks, I'm just going to be using the Hard Candy Fox in a Box Pressed Powder. So it comes with four different colors and then you just swirl them all together. I'm going to tap off the excess on the back of my hand, just really lightly dust it on my face. I don't want the blush to be the main focal point or to be too overwhelming. Lips, I actually have two lip options. The first is the Revlon Just Bitten Kissable Balm Stain in Romantic. So I'm just going to apply this one first. I really like the balm stain because it applies a really nice wash of color and this is a great way to go if you want to just dip your toes into applying brighter colors. Also, after a few minutes the stain sets and it really won't budge or go anywhere so this is the mistletoe friendly option, if you know what I mean. So if you don't, if you want to go all out or you don't necessarily have somebody under the mistletoe waiting for you, that's okay. Um, you can go ahead and go all out with the CoverGirl Lipstick in Hot Passion. I also really like this lipstick because I read in an online interview that this is the color that Taylor Swift wears. So naturally when I heard that, I went out and bought it. And since it's CoverGirl, it's not too expensive, which was really great. And as a lipstick just by itself, it is really great because it's really pigmented and creamy and lasts a long time without leaving that dreaded ring around my lips. So I've definitely enjoyed this. The finished look I really hope you enjoyed. If you have any suggestions for future videos that you would like to see from me, feel free to leave them in the comments. Uh, I really hope you all have a happy, happy holidays and stay safe. And we'll see you all next time. Bye.